Right, good evening everybody. Um, today, just recently I received this uh, message from this guy called Icarius on my Discord channel basically asking how to create expressions for some of the models that are converted, specifically the widow maker model. So uh, I thought to use this widow maker uh, model as a, as my template to show how to how do I use this um, model to create the expressions on her face, right? So basically, the what I have the the what I did right is that the widow maker um, she doesn't have any morphs. So what she has is the original bone uh, rigging, original rigging from the Overwatch game. So basically, all the the bones and the, the rigging that you see down here is uh, whatever comes with the game. So with this right, any of the expressions that the game can make, theoretically, you can recreate them here as well, right? So, say for example, if I want her to 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 frown, uh, do a frowny face. So what I need to do is basically just move the bones around. So in this case, I want her her eyebrow to go down a little bit. You know, uh, make it look pretty fierce. and move a little bit so her eyes itself will also need to be adjusted a, a little bit here and there you know just a, um, a little bit on the corner for expressions right you don't really need sometimes you don't need to move a lot of things at the same time or, or you just need to move a little bit and uh, you'll be able to convey on what the the emotion or the expressions that you're looking for right so maybe i'll just close the jaw and okay so i need to move this a little bit as well so now she has a neutral face a neutral mouth and uh i'll move the line a little bit Okay, so basically the idea is that you just need to take the parts that you want to move and move them around you know a little bit here a little bit there enough already okay so just move them a little bit here and there uh, to be able to get the expression that you're looking for it's not really very difficult I think I prefer this method because I can customize the expression to my liking compared to if you are using uh, morphs you are basically stuck with whatever the morph maker has available for you right so it's, it, it is actually easier and in the perfect world you will want to have both both uh, both morphs as well as rigging and uh, bones and rigging right so but uh, you don't in this case because for this particular model uh, it is it's a XPS model that I converted over so they don't have any bones and or rigging so it's uh, sorry they don't have any uh, morphs no no shape keys so in this case it's all just using the bones so uh, with this in a little less than two minutes I have a frowny you know serious face uh, so yeah basically all you need to do is just to move the the mouth uh, move move whatever you want you know so now I have a snarly face No, she's not very happy. <laughs> okay, so it depends on what you want. Uh, you just need to move the, the the bones to suit the face that you are uh, suit the expression that you're looking for. So you can rotate them if you need, if if need be. You know, uh, you can move them around. Just don't move to the point where you know things get started starts to get really distorted. Yeah. So, but other than that. Uh, because by right, uh, you should have some li some kind of limits, but uh, it's, it's extremely tedious to set it up. So I'll uh, and also uh, some of my commission, especially for particularly for this uh, widow maker, the commissioner that actually asked me to do this is uh, ex blurb, who for some reason love. Uh, I I some of his work has very exaggerated uh, expressions, so he requires this stretching this kind of you know extreme stretching motions uh, which I subsequently left behind because 
is easier than make putting limits to all the, the all the work and since I do a lot of conversion so in the end it's easier for me this way so yeah forgive me for that sorry for that okay so uh, back to topic basically in terms of expression right this all this basically all you need to do right so if you want something happier and you just move the move the uh, bones to make her smile you know yeah nothing really very uh, fancy or very complicated it's just simple simple expressions so yeah of course it's easier to start from the base so if you have if you want to change her expression just return her return back to the basic to the to the default settings and then move things around so whatever expressions you want just need to make it uh, just need to move things around until you have the expression that you want yeah simple <laughs> okay this, this is a bit, a bit goofy so where was I yeah, so you just select the head, go to edit, uh, object, zero, and zero poses, zero item poses. Uh, oops, something went wrong. Object, zero, pose. Okay, so now you have the default uh, pose and you can start over again if you need to, right? Okay, so uh, this is the end of the tutorial. I hope you find that useful. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, goodbye, good night.